Hi guys, what's up? It is day 22 and I am actually a lot more alive today than I was yesterday. Today's gonna be a lot like yesterday. We're gonna do an herb run and then we're just gonna send right into grinding slayer. And you know what? My watch time on my last video was up a lot more than it usually is and I am have to believe that's because I ranted in the first part of it. So I'm just gonna start talking a lot more about my random day <laughs> while I do random shit until we can get to bossing and then I can start focusing on that. So today's day was phenomenal. It was so nice. Today is like the literally the first real nice day that we've had in a while. 71 out. Nice. It's a little cold in my house so I have my sweater on but it was nice at work. I loved being outside. It's gonna suck for tomorrow because I have Emshaw and I'm gonna be stuck inside all day but I know it's gonna be really nice outside. Aww. Aww. Double aww. Apart from it being a super lovely day outside, I had a really nice time playing with the sprinklers and just kind of checking and making sure everything was going all right. And the cool thing about it is that I'm really left to my own device a lot of the time. So I don't really have to talk to anyone. I just have my headphones on and I just get to like chill and hang out and check on the water and look at the pretty green grass. Oh, but I found out some really good news today. I found out that Futurama is getting a reboot. And I am all about that. Like, I saw that it was coming back to TV, like, a couple months ago, that they were going to start airing the reruns again, which I thought is just dope. I don't know why they took it off in the first place. Um, I just literally had rewatched the entire thing on Hulu or Netflix or wherever the hell I had it. <laughs> and But now they're actually coming out with, like, ten new episodes that's supposed to start in March. Like, how awesome is that? Ooh, we got a fragment. Harvesting Fragment. CD Business XP, we'll take it! Hey, it's now level 2, hell yeah! Maybe it'll save my Rainar Seed! Oh, it totally did! Yes, paying off! Paying off! Love it, love to see it! Alright, ooh, and when I bought a fan, one of those oscillating fans for the bedroom, it's so nice! So nice! Because with the two dogs, it literally makes that room at least 10 degrees hotter than the rest of the house so the heater can be on and it could be 66 in the rest of the house but in the bedroom it feels like it's 80. so the fan has been really really nice and i'm really glad that uh, i got it because man has it been helping wow people are just swagging it up dropped their entire trailblazer i don't know why people don't want them like they look cool i was i was so jealous when i first started and everyone had like the cool outfits and I'm like, where the hell did they get those? And then of course, you know, El Planco told me and I was like, oh, that makes a lot more sense. Yeah, it looks like all of my snape grass died. That sucks. In addition to the Futurama reboot, there's actually the Percy Jackson TV series that Disney Plus is working on. And I'm kind of stoked for that, not even gonna lie, because I was really into the Percy Jackson movies. I really liked them. And I was kind of sad that there was, what, only the two, maybe? Was there three? I don't know. I don't remember. But I really, I really enjoyed them. And so now I'm, I'm really happy to see that they're going to be working on a, uh, a TV series for it. And I can't wait for it. I think it's, ooh, and I heard they're coming out with a Mass Effect or they're talking about a Mass Effect TV series. Oh, where the dude that voices Captain Anderson actually plays him. Like, I think that would be awesome. I, I would be all about a Mass Effect TV series. I can't even tell you because that game has been my, like my number one video game since forever. Now, I like Dragon Age and I love games where player choice affects the actual game. Like, I just love them. But Mass Effect always holds that little special place in my heart. We'll never have to pickpocket again in our lives, you know, until I go back to my main character. Well, even then, though, it'd probably be more like the group Iron Man that I pickpocket on. Because on my main, I'm just going to... Be like, hey, El Planko, you got some, you got some prayer potions for me, and he's like, yeah, and then he'll give me a stack of like a hundred, which will last me a while. So, <laughs> uh, yeah, that's how that works. So it seems like we don't have enough snape grass at the moment because a lot of the ones that we had planted died, but we fixed that. We planted more, and we will have more on our next cleanup, which will probably be tomorrow. But right now, we're sitting at 83 prayer potions, and we have 22 that are unfinished. All right, we are going. 
actually we have 31 that are unfinished because i didn't see those and now we are going to fill up our inventory full of food and we're gonna head off and do our slayer task at trollheim i am racking my brain trying to think if there was anything else kind of sort of interesting that happened to me today and honestly i can't think of anything except for Ooh, actually i can so i'm a real big my hero academia fan and I've seen everything, I'm up to date on everything, except for the fact that there was a movie that somehow snuck under my radar that I did not know existed. Uh, so yeah, I've seen two heroes, but now there's Heroes Rising, which I have not seen. So I definitely need to jump on that and watch that, like now, because I absolutely love that anime. I love a lot of anime, actually. Um, I'm currently watching um, Platinum's End, on Funimation and I'm stuck right now because um, I've watched all the English dubbed ones and they're dubbing them every Friday so I'll get a I'll, I'll watch again next Friday but I actually am really really enjoying it I didn't think I would um, I honestly think that it's made I haven't looked this up but I think that it's made by the same creators as Death Note and I only say that because it's it feels like a complete 180 from Death Note it feels like the same thing, but the opposite, where like, um, instead of a god of death, Shinigami coming down and bestowing powers upon someone, it is an angel that bestows the powers. And um, instead of wanting to kill people for the greater good, he doesn't want to kill a single living soul. In the anime Death Note, Light says, well, why don't you give, rant something like flying if it was flying? everyone kind of wants to fly anyway to know that feeling that's a lot more alluring than the shinigami eyes and here we are in this new anime that feels a lot like death note but the opposite and they get wings they get to fly there's just a lot of similarities of it being completely the opposite i like it i like it though i'm enjoying it i enjoy a lot of anime it's been hard for me lately because like i've like watched all the ones that i know about so i've been trying to find new ones so if you guys have any suggestions let me know my big genres are um psychological and horror those are the ones that i really like in anime so not that i don't like like action you know i like uh action and fantasy too like sao and naruto uh ooh, unidentified fragments combat come on be a good one be a good one unholy ranger god damn it I mean, thank you, but god dang it. <laughs> anyway, that's that's my rant on anime right now. Um, hey, reach combat level 150 points. That's awesome. And our prayer has now gone up a level as well. Heck yeah. We've also put a pretty big dent in our troll task. And we've used all of our food. So I think this is as good a time as any to call it for tonight and i will pick it back up tomorrow and we'll do the same thing and then friday we'll probably just spend all day grinding up till 87 and i'm sure we'll knock it out like we're 72 we got one level and we only spent what an hour at it so i'm sure on friday if i give it a good 9 10 hours we can definitely hit 87. all right guys i'll see you tomorrow